Saturday night you're looking for that game tie goal in the third. Tonight you got it. You got it. How how much did it feel different tonight? Well, we we've been playing consistent hockey over the last couple of while, and you just stick with it and. Um, yeah, it was a good shot from the point, and uh, it was a good brush entry into the zone, and I was able to keep possession, and it was a good shot from the point. So uh, just sticking with it and being consistent, um, you know, whether things are going your way or not, uh, um, big point for us. And what are you saying to the other guys as you're struggling to find wins, but still sticking in games? Yeah, it, it's, uh, it's a tough league, and our division's tough. It's tight. It's, you know, it's been like that ever since I've been here, so... Uh, just stick with it. There's a lot of highs and lows. This season's a roller coaster, so uh, you just gotta be consistent with what you're doing mentally and physically to uh, give yourself the best chance. And how good is Mason Johnson in the last couple of games? He's great. He's been awesome. Uh, I've been seeing it for two years, and uh, more, you know, he's getting some opportunity. He's bouncing on it, but he's been the same. Uh, I just talked about consistency. He's a true pro, and uh, I'm really happy for him. How do you guys deal with, you know, looking at the standings and it's like four points, four points from second place and three points, four points from last place? Yeah, it's, it's tough. Every, every game's challenging. Uh, you know, I think we have the least amount of teams. I mean, from what I look at in our division, out of all the divisions. So um, everybody's in it. Everybody's got good teams. And uh, there's no free ones out there. This type of game where you dominate overtime and probably should have won. I mean, you know, the frustration, obviously. Yeah, there's some frustration because uh, you do the right things and you don't get rewarded for it, and uh, a small sample size. But uh, you know, doing the right—it's it's cliche, but um, uh, yeah, guys, they, they play. We play great. Uh, you know, they're a really well structured team, so they don't really give up much, and. Uh, yeah, it came down in a shootout. So uh, we did a lot of really good things tonight. I'm sure we're gonna, you know, all we'll watch the video and you know see that, and get better from it, and work on things that we didn't. But um, it's just about sticking with it. Came back from a goal down twice. Yeah, but yet the fans were frustrated with the last 15 seconds. Uh -huh. How do you rebound from the home crowd booing you to having that kind of start? Yeah, in, in the five on five, right? Where we, yeah. yeah. Right at the end of the yeah. Period where it was. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, they want to see a score goal and win the game. Their heart's in the right place. So, uh, you know, in that situation, they, they got five guys back, and they play a really good structured defensive game. So um, at that point, you know, it's tough to skate through the five guys and go down and score. And, you know, chances are you're going to turn that puck over. So uh, we decided we wanted to get the point, and we have really good team speed. And three on three, you know, usually works our advantage. If you look at the beginning of the year, we were winning a lot of games. So, uh, um, Time and a place, you know, game what, 60, 60? So, but yeah, the fans just want to see us win, so uh, I'm all for it, I'll take those boos. Basically it was weighing the odds and the odds of scoring were pretty slim. Yeah, yeah. And a turnover, you know, made yeah, exactly. the point that, it's, that you need. Yeah, exactly, they have the top guys out there, and they kind of play a, a trap with the red line there when we have full possessions. 